In order to strengthen the efforts to popularize the science and technology among the society, Government of Gujarat has decided to establish state-of-art regional science museums at five locations. For the development of regional science museum at Rajput, a land of about 10 acres has been allotted at Madhabar. The site is situated adjacent to the famous Ishtavya Mahadev Temple Complex. Our vision for the project is to conceive a best-in-class science museum which is both educating and entertaining. And to expose the visitor to new ways of thinking about science, to experience science and inspire innovations to serve the general public. Institutional building of such character tries to evolve the concepts from the fundaments of various scientific fields. The overall base of scientific knowledge is rooted in the primary calculations. In general, calculations are validated against the range from zero to infinity. The building design is borrowing the metaphor of zero for the plan organization. All the galleries and other components are laid in a radial formation to define a strong sense of center. The site is identified on the mounted topography which is gradually sloping towards the Ishwarya Park and the lake beyond. The pyramidical form expression provides the sense of stability relationship between the earth and the sky. The building is approached from the road adjoining to the Ishwarya Madhav temple from where the visitor enters into a central plaza under a large canopy. The character of the courtyard is strengthened by designing an amphitheater towards the administration side. The courtyard acts as a nucleus around which visitors are navigating between the galleries. The visitors can experience the play of light and shadow in the plaza throughout the year. By designing an elegant canopy structure providing a semi-open, comfortable, naturally ventilated sheltered public space. From here the visitor travels along the internal street to the science galleries. The Nobel Prize Gallery is placed in the beginning of the gallery zone. It introduces the life and chronological history of the Nobel Prize. There are replicas and stories of the invention by scientists and ceiling hanging photo collages of the winners of the Peace Prize. The Machine Engineering Gallery features many exhibits that showcase the machine and parts produced in the local industry as well as envisions the future trends of the field. The House Staff Works Gallery features working models of selected exhibits from transport, energy and anything and everything around our daily life. Most of these galleries have mezzanine to provide extension at the upper level. Robotics Gallery is thematically zoned into working replicas of battlefield, miniature, space and daily life robots. Ceramic and Glass Gallery explains various types and manufacturing processes, their contemporary applications into various industries. Life Science Gallery comprises exhibits from botany, zoology, microbiology and human body. Each gallery is separated by a thematic courtyard along the street in order to allow vistas towards the lake and borrows natural light and air circulation in the building. Outdoor exhibits placed in these courtyards provided identity to the each gallery. One keeps relating to infinite view toward the lake and park while navigating on the radial corridor by forming an alternative sequence of gallery and courtyards.
The Science Park will feature various outdoor exhibits and an amphitheater for large gatherings. This will be mostly natural landscape requiring little maintenance. For the design of the Regional Science Museum we wanted to create a place that responded to the local building traditions, climate, context and the science museum typology. We believe the museum will not only serve as a regional science attraction but also as a gathering place to promote harmony and a sense of belonging to the regional community.